Judge, real Same. quick, uh, we're going to take another break, but uh, as I mentioned before our, our last break, uh, talk about the time really allotted that you're supposed to take when filling out such a, a, a long ballot. Well, Tiffany, you know, I didn't make up these rules. Right, they're right. In the, <laughs> they're in the Code of Alabama. Yeah. It basically says that as one goes into the voting booth, and uh -huh. these days it's not the type of voting booth where you pull the uh, curtain behind right. you and all that sort of thing, but as you go into the voting booth, uh, according to the code, someone has four minutes mm -hmm. uh, to uh, to mark their ballot, and then, like I said, it's a long ballot. Now, let me say that there's not someone in Jefferson County that <laughs> has a stopwatch sure. that's there timing you, but right. the, the code of Alabama does say four minutes, uh -huh. uh, and then it goes on to say that if it's not a busy election and someone wants to take longer than four right. minutes, it's no one's going to be pushing you, and uh, and then they almost then they have if someone brings it to the attention to their attention they've been there longer than four minutes sure. and then they receive one additional minute <laughs> now I can say in Jefferson County we won't have anyone there we have poll worker schools we've already yeah. had them uh, this last week and we didn't tell any poll worker to have a stopwatch yeah. and time sure. voters but it is going to be a lengthy ballot yeah. and we will have long lines just come prepared it. I guess yeah, try to do your homework prepared. beforehand we've got